All right, what's going on, y'all? Give me a sec here. I need a minute to clean my hands here. Hey, real quick uh, video here. I want to do this video about this guy, Kai Sinet. If I said it right, I'm looking at the uh, article about this guy. He's a social media influencer of Twitch with 20 million subscribers those are a lot of subscribers and i didn't even know about this guy until today uh this incident where he was arrested uh i think it was union square park in new york so somewhere in manhattan okay central manhattan where he was trying to pass out some playstation like a playstation giveaway and there was people out there i don't know acting unruly and some people i guess were fighting one person was hospitalized, okay? And it took the, the New, York, New York police like two hours to break this incident up. Uh, I understand that public transportation also was held up, okay? Because of that, and he's being charged right now for inciting a riot. And I'm thinking, wow, you know what I'm saying? And I think that he was just trying to do something good, maybe to try to promote himself, okay? And because of that, now he's in himself, you know, a, like a serious legal entanglement. Okay. Now, maybe this video, and I'm thinking if you're a podcaster or you are an inspiring one, okay, because I know that there's guys that listen to me that I listen to. You know, I mean, this channel here is a small channel, but it's mine. You probably need to realize that this the words are power. Okay, and your influence it speaks a lot. Okay, like this little channel here is like 550 subscribers. That guy's like 20 million, so that's enough. If he wanted to do an election, he could sway an election definitely without a doubt. Okay, so in some cases, with that many subscribers, your influence and words are power. Okay, and you know, maybe he didn't realize the magnitude of it, but probably in the eyes of others and then probably law enforcement and the city government, all right, then this, this is probably, well, it's not probably the way they prob uh, they saw it is it's a problem, okay? Uh, maybe I'm just, I would think if you're going to probably protest or be an activist or do something that big, it's usually have to be something that's going to be organized within the city, be if you have that, they, they have to know anyway uh, to do that so you can be able to have the permits and then the police or whatever so they can be able to, to direct any other uh, public transportation, okay, uh, traffic and that type of stuff, okay, uh, that and your own personal security. So it's a lot of tentacles that you need to do something, you know, uh, that uh, that size, particularly if you have a lot of followers and a big influence. I didn't really realize that today, until today, all right? So without it, I know that, you know, there's a lot of good people out there that don't mean it, but you get some people that act up, particularly like if it's free stuff, there a lot of people want to come out to it. And probably if they can't get their hands on something free, a lot of times, you know how it goes, or somebody's going to act out, next thing you know, it'd be some crap broke out, Okay. So, yeah, he's being charged for that. In closing, I just want to say that this, you know, for him being a young black man, okay, but, you know, and then on top of that, everybody knows him. A lot of people knows it, uh, this man, but for you to come and kind of break the traditional nine to five or I don't know, the traditional like work structure and you're able to make a lot of money doing that millions of dollars in which he's probably facing that he's going to have to probably pay in fines and also, you know, in bails and all that. Okay. Legal fees. Uh, I think that they're up. I hate to say this, but they, they want to get you. They want to hang you out to dry. Okay. And they're just awaiting your downfall and they're just waiting for it at just the right time. So, it's one of the things that, you know, really, no matter what you do, if you look like me, you really got to be careful, okay? 
I mean, there's not a lot of everybody's not well wishes. Everybody's not well wishes and uh, everybody is not uh, out to try to help you or want to see you do well. So let me know. Uh, all right. A lot of people, in other words, are jealous about because he makes so much damn money. Let me know what you think about the video. Like, subscribe, share. Uh, cash App, dollar sign, Winston Spivey if you want to donate. And uh, let me know your thoughts about this, this uh, video. Thanks for your time.